Okay, okay, he's got to deal with this. No way, and he's in. No way, Ronaldo scores against his former club, guys. And no way, he does have an adult celebration as well. Of course he does. Hello there guys and welcome back to the FIFA 22 Real Madrid career mode and today we've got episode 8 and coming up in today's episode guys one of the games is the second leg against Man United in the round of 16. And also coming up then in today's episode we've got Barcelona and Real Sociedad in La Liga guys as you can see both of them in the top 4 but we are miles ahead now at the top of the table. And as we've seen then over the last few episodes Mbappe has started putting the ball in the back of the net quite a lot for us guys as you can see 18 goals in 23 matches a better record than Suarez. Benzema just behind him along with Depay. And also in today's episode then we are going to go ahead and promote some of these players from the Youth Academy guys. As you can see Mikel Garcia, one of our best Youth Academy players, was valued at 1.7 million. So we're going to go ahead and promote him in today's episode and try and get him out on loan. And so then guys, you're looking forward to today's episode. Please let me know by smashing the like button down below. And also guys, if you are new here to the channel. You want to see more videos like this every single day, hit the red subscribe button. So let's go ahead then and get to some of your guys' comments before we get into some games in today's episode. And into the first comment which says, if you were to sign Ronaldo and Ramos, what would happen to Militao and Benzema? Now quickly, in the last episode, we did mention about the possibility of re-signing both into the team. Now, of course, if we did sign them both, Ronaldo would, to be honest, just rotate with Benzema, especially in the big games. Of course, I would like to try and give Jovic game time as well, of course. Ramos... Pretty much the same for him. He would rotate in the big games of Militao. So to be fair, is it worth splashing out all that money? And here we go then into the second comment, guys, which says, We like the double episodes. Are you doing player career once again today? And now, are you guys really enjoying the double episodes? Because right now, as you guys are watching this, I'm now back at work. So it's going to be hard to do double episodes. But I could do a double episode on a Friday and a Saturday. So if you guys are interested in that, let me know down below in the comments. And here we go then, our final comment for today's episode, which says, I resigned at Ronaldo and Ramos back in my career mode. Both were too slow, a huge mistake. I ended up selling them and bought Harlan and Rumi Diaz much, much better. Now, I did see a few comments down below mentioning this, how Ronaldo and both Ramos just aren't the same anymore in this FIFA. Now, of course, that could be just due to the gameplay. I'm not too sure. But yeah, guys, it's a, re it's a big risk signing both Ronaldo and Ramos back into the team. But again, Haaland and Diaz, you know, wouldn't be bad signings. Well, let's go ahead then and get into some games in today's episode, guys. Our first one, we are going to go ahead and simulate this one. As you guys can see, I've rotated the side quite a bit here. But let's go ahead. Quick sim, come on. Let's start the episode off with a win. And there we go. Camavinga, though, picking up a red card. Vinicius Jr. and Barella with the goals. And now I did say then, guys, we're going to go ahead and promote Mikel Garcia. Now, let me know down below in the comments, is there anyone else that we should go ahead and promote? Now, this guy here, I think we should just go ahead and release him. But again, this guy doesn't look too bad here. Simon Vasquero, I'm going to guess that's how you pronounce that. But again, Mikel Garcia, let's promote him and let's try and get him out on loan. And let's get into our next one then. We're taking on Real Sociedad. We're at home for this one. And now, if you Real Madrid fans will know that yesterday, Real Madrid did just lose to Real Sociedad 2-1 in La Liga, their first loss of the season. Now, into this one, of course, not our first game, not our first loss, but definitely an important one we have to win. They're in the top four, guys. You can see the team, Valverde coming in, Hazard coming in. Let's get into it. Header, here we go, Benzema down to Mbappe. You can just get it back across there. Benzema, okay, tried to get it to him. We've got ourselves a corner. Decent attack there from us, but here we go, corner now. Whipped in, Tony Kroos. Okay, there we go, the header's there, and it's a great... Okay, is that headed away or is that saved? I'm not too sure. We've got picked it back up here, though. Alaba. Okay, what to go for goal? Benzema, finish. Go on. Oh, that's a great block. There we go. Pass inside. Tony Kroos. Play it once again. Here we go. Hazard now. A chance to go inside with this one. Okay, onto the edge of the box. Hazard. Go for goal. Why not? And, oh, what a save. What a save that is. Benzema, chance to get it out to Hazard once again. Hazard really involved in this one. Ball roll. Oh, tried to cut it back. Didn't work out. Benzema looking for it outside. Down to Mendy. Go on. Mendy's on side. Okay, play that back, play that back, that's a great pass, Hazard, okay, a little bit, okay, Benzema, round, finish, go on, oh, it's a great deflection. Tony Kroos can see Hazard making a run, down for Benzema, uh, Mbappe, sorry, my mistake, Mbappe, go on, just keep that one, that's great, play it inside, Hazard's got to score, he's got to score, surely. Here we go, Valverde, oh, taking off him. Real Sociedad now have got an attack of their own, just before we enter into half time, no, Isaac into Silva, into Isaac. Great save by Courtois. Oh, here we go. Isaac breaking forward. Plays it out wide now. Poor two. Oh, this is great. This is great from Real Sociedad. We really can't stop them. Courtois just catch that one. Tony Kroos plays it forward. Here we go. Benzema now. And surely we've got to score at some point in this game. Surely we have to. Another corner. Unbelievable amount of corners we've had. Tony Kroos. Great cross in. Okay, it's going to fall. It's going to fall. We're going to get the header on that. Casemiro. Okay, we need someone in the middle. We need someone in the middle. Benzema just can't reach it. 
Benzema going to hold it up. Go on. Hazard. Here we go. He's on a run. Surely this is 1-0. Surely. Hazard go for power. And he's in. There we go. We get a goal in this game. 63 minutes in. It took a while. But I feel like we've got the lead we deserve. Obviously, Real Sociedad causing us a few problems, but not many. You know, we've really been a dominant team here. Here's the replay once again. Simple as that. And it's now 1-0. All right, here we go. Isaac now into the box once again. Plays it out wide. Yozabal, who can cause, definitely cause problems for us. Isaac now pass inside. Don't give away. No way. Is that Gilfy Sigurdsson? Is that Gilfy Sigurdsson? And it is. There you go. 1-1 one, one in this game. 1-1. One, one. It could end 2-1 like real life. But, come on, we've got to be doing better here. Here's the replay. Yozabal, Isaac, link it up really well. Pass inside, and there you go. Sigurdsson, first time, first touch finish. It's 1-1. One, one. Benzema just got to time that right, and he does. Here we go. Mbappe's away. Mbappe, come on. Ball roll that. Get in behind. Finish. No. Finish again. Surely someone's got to just finish that. So we're going to make some subs in this game. Then Rodrigo is going to come on. Barella's going to come on as well, guys. Just fresh it up a little bit and just push for that last-minute winner. Oh, could be a late winner. Could be a late winner here from Real Sociedad. Poor two. No. No. No way. A Yozabal makes it 2-1. There you go. There is the late winner. Wasn't for us. It was for Real Sociedad. And yeah, same as the real life result. 2-1. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe that. And by the way, Coutinho coming out of goal, that wasn't me. That was not me at all. He brought himself out and then I just carried it on. So I thought, well, why not? Let's commit for it. He comes out here and that's it. There you go. Yozabel, right place, right time. And I'm sure that's this game. Done and dusted now. Maybe one last attempt. Nope. There we go, full time. And here's the league table then. After that defeat, guys, we're associated out at staying fourth place. We're still top of the table by quite a margin. Still there by 11 points. And up next then, guys, we have the biggest game possibly in today's episode. This game determines whether we progress through into the quarterfinals. And here you can see the lineup then from both teams, guys. You can see United going with pretty much the same lineup, but I think the midfield too has changed. I don't remember Fred and McTominay playing it in the first game. But either way, here we go. Let's get into this right now. A few players, you know, not up to full fitness, but it should do the job. Okay, here we go. Ronaldo, not Ronaldo. My United, it is almost Ronaldo causing problems for us early on in this one. Casemiro plays it through the middle. Benzema just going to hold it up. Here we go, Mbappe. Let's go. Okay, Carvajal could have had that. Carvajal could have. Mbappe now looking for a little bit of support. Can play this one back. Benzema might just go for goal here. Benzema, it's in. There we go. 22 minutes in. Benzema, what a goal that is. And we make it 1-1. But it's still not over yet. 1-1 over the two legs. we still got to get ourselves another goal. And of course, watch out for United. Who did cause us problems early on. You can see Mbappe here. Just looks for the pass. Benzema takes the touch. And the finish is on there. It's a great goal. There we go, Sancho looking for that pass. Forward to Ronaldo, I can imagine. Sancho, oh, Militao. There we go. Not messing around. Mbappe, just keep going, just keep going, oh, he's offside, let's, let's release Vinicius Jr. down his left-hand side, okay, here we go, cross into the box, see if we can find anyone, Mbappe at the near post, and De Gea forced to the save, okay, we could be in trouble, could be in trouble, Sancho now, oh, that's a great, that's a great bit of skill, Sancho, now Bruno Fernandes, and saved by Courtois, thankfully, he saved us, Courtois kicks it out wide, here we go, Mbappe, feed that one through, here we go, Modric now. We know he's not got the best pace towards the back post. Oh, okay, Vinicius Jr. just couldn't get there. Here we go, we've still got it though. Vinicius Jr., okay, back onto the pitch. Here we go. Let's keep this, Mendy. Let's keep this alive. Pass inside. Okay, finds Mbappe, takes the touch. The finish might just be there, but it's a good block. United play it out wide. Rashford charging into the box. Albert, you need to cover that. There we go, done that. Clear that, just get it cleared. Casemiro to Modric. Mbappe is going to go for goal. And because De Gea, what a save. Come on, come on, the goal's got to come. United are causing a few problems for us, but we are the bigger threat right now. We are at home. We've got to make sure we progress through. Here we go, Mendy can play it over, Tony Kroos. And now Vinicius Junior's free. Okay, I think he was offside. Benzo is going to take it. Play it down. Here we go, Carver Howell. Okay, just got to look for a little chip. Go on, Mbappe, go on. Imagine that was it, guys. Imagine that was it. Casemiro, Modric now. Carver Howell, go on, Carver Howell, go on. Here we go, Carver Howell. Pass back inside. This time to Benzema. Benzema looking for Vinicius Jr. And he almost got there. Almost found him. Okay, we need people tracking back. We need people tracking back. There we go. Casemiro is great. Okay, still not dealt with. Sancho now. Okay, out wide. Rashford. Could this be the goal that gets United through? Could this be the goal? Ronaldo. No, he's played it. No, 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 no. Couture. That's great. Kept us in this one massively. Here we go then, our last attempt of the 90 before heading into extra time. Benzema, come on, we've got to get it in towards him here. Just somewhere in that middle. There we go, Benzema, please. Oh, he's headed away easily. Head that one back in. Oh, I think that's going to be it. That is going to be it for the 90. 
It's now extra time. So I'm going to make a bold move here, guys. I'm going to take Benzema and Modric off. Going to bring on Hazard. I'm going to put Mbappe at strike and bring Barella on as well. Let's see how we do now in this extra time. Vinicius Junior can play that one for Valverde. Valverde can see a pass. Mbappe, please. Oh, it falls. It falls to Barella. Just can't get control of it, though. Oh, Sancho is away. Sancho is away. We can't catch up. Militao is trying his best to catch up right now. Okay, caught up. Just got to get the tackle in. Just got to do the last little bit of work now. Get the tackle in. And, okay, I thought we might have been worse off there, but we're not. Mbappe. Here we go. He's away. Hazard is away. He's away. Look at the pace. Look at the pace he's got. Finish. Please. Finish. De Gea once again. Should have gone near post. Should have gone near post. De Gea really keeping United in this. Here we go. United now on the break. Can they cause any problems? We've just got to make sure everyone's ready here. Let's get team press on just quickly here. Come on. Press, press, press everyone. Okay, no one's pressing. It's just good that they're in the box though, to be fair. And no, how has he got past? Ronaldo Militao, that is amazing. Mbappe cannot release. Here we go. Vinicius Jr. Vinicius Jr. Could he score a late winner? Going to drag it back. Going to go. Vinicius Jr. God, De Gea, man. I'm not looking forward to penalties if he's in goal, of course, because he's just, he's amazing. Okay, so there's one minute added on. Could be a late goal. Could definitely be a late goal here. Just got to just gotta defend. Just got to defend. There we go. There we go. Just get it cleared. Just get it cleared. There we go. It's going to be penalties. It's going to be penalties in this one. Here it is then, guys. This is how we're going to decide who goes through into the quarterfinals. Hazard is going to step up first. I wish right now that I subbed on Jovic for Vinicius Jr. But it is what it is. We've got to deal with what we've got. Let's get into this. Here we go, Hazard right now. Let's go. I'm going to go bottom right. I'm going to go bottom right here. Here we go, Hazard. Come on, please. Please. No way has he saved that straight away. Ronaldo, where's he going? I reckon he's going top left. He's gone bottom right. He's, do he's done us. He's done us. Ronaldo has scored. Mbappe now. We're going to go top right here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. And it's another save. That's unreal. That is unreal. I'm not having this. Rashford. Save. Oh, he's done us. He's chipped it. No. Come on. We're off to a bad start here. We're really off to a bad start. Alaba. Why do we go top left? Top left. Do we go top left? Yeah, let's go top left. Here we go. Come on. No, he's missed that. He's absolutely missed it. He skied it. No way. This is all down to me now. Got to save this. Thomas Muller. Thomas Muller. Save. Oh, he's saved. There we go. What a save that is. Come on. We can get back in this now. Come on. We can't miss this. Looks a little bit blurry right now. I'm not sure why. Barella, come on. Come on. Come on. And he's in. There we go. Come on. Here we go. Courtois. He's got to save this. Fred's he's easily going right. He's easily going right. He's gone left. No way. And United have done it. United are through into the quarterfinals and we've been knocked out. I can't believe it, guys. I feel so bad right now. All we needed was another goal in that game. We just couldn't score it. United go through on penalties. So there we go then, guys. We are out of the Champions League. I cannot believe it. I, don't, I totally take all the blame for that. Again, penalties this year, I seem to be awful at them. Last year on FIFA 21, if you guys remember, I was pretty good at them. This year, uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm just not great. But let's get into our next one then, guys. We've made a few changes to the side. Blanco coming in, Cavario coming in. And like I say, we need to you know, focus on the youth now. Because again, next season, we want to be winning that Champions League. But here we go, Maloka, bottom of the table. Let's see, can we get a win? We've had back-to-back -back defeats. And there we go, a good win. Carvajal picking up a red, though. Rodrigo with a goal. And, okay, Vinicius Jr. and Benzema. So we have got a loan offer then from Mikel Garcia. Again, going to take him on a one-year loan. And again, guys, let's get him out there and let's get him some experience. And I've got to say then, guys, the board are not happy with us whatsoever. You can see our manager rating has now gone down to 55. We failed to win, obviously, the Champions League. We got knocked out of the Copa del Rey, knocked out of the Supercopa. Now we've got to make sure that La Liga doesn't slip out of our hands. Let's get into this one then. We do have Barcelona and we are at home for this one. So guys, I think a win in this will pretty much secure the La Liga title. Obviously not officially, but I think a win against Barcelona will do it. You can see they're struggling at the moment with fitness issues. Be interesting to see after this game, did they make it through in the Champions League? But here we go into this. Carvajal picked up a red, so Wrench is in the team. I don't know if you guys noticed then, going into this game, Barcelona now have a centre-back partnership on Nicolas Sewell and Skriniar. So talk about... You know, sorting out your problems at the back. They went ahead and signed them two. And here they go now on the attack. Frankie de Jong. Okay, pass inside to Luke de Jong. Okay, there we go. Clear that, clear that, please. Okay, Depay with the header. And luckily dealt with. Tony Kroos out wide. Here we go now. Hazard, who's on. Cross coming in towards Benzema at the near post. Headed away easily by Skriniar. Well, that's a good ball over the top, to be fair. That's a good ball over the top. Luke de Jong holding up the ball well. Depay now getting involved in the play. Pedri, come on, let's let's not lose another game. Come on, we've had too many defeats in today's episode. Debele, 
Luke De Jong. Oh, come on, just just get a foot in, lads. No way, no way. Courtois, what a save. Memphis Depay now on the left. I feel like everyone's out to get us in this episode. And wow, Barcelona with another effort on goal. And we've got nothing so far. Now they've got themselves a corner. Dembele to take. It's into the box. Should be headed away. And no way, wrench. Wow, okay, wow. What a ball, what a ball. Mbappe's got to get it in. Mbappe's got to get it in. It's in. There we go, 1-0. That is all down to Tony Kroos with the assist. What an assist that is. And Mbappe makes it 1-0. Now, every time we face Barcelona this season, we have beaten them. And I want to make sure that is the same now in this game. Another El Clasico. Hopefully another win. Great ball over the top. Mbappe, great control. Unbelievable control. And then curls it into the back of the net. Here we go, Barella. Maybe release Mbappe once again. Mbappe may play this one inside for Benzema. And okay, wrong choice. Wrong choice. Nicolas Sewell knew what was going on. Hazard inside. Benzema. Mbappe, back through. Oh, that's a great back pass. Benzema just can't catch up in time. Okay, that's a great ball. Oh, it's even better defending. Melitao just keeping us in the lead here before half time. Head that one away. Head that clear. There we go. Cleared away by Wrench. Barella now able to get us forward. Mbappe just got to time that one for Benzema. He's, there we go. Go on, he's away. Benzema just got to be a little bit faster. Oh, it's great defending from Barcelona again. Dembele plays it to Frankie de Jong. He plays it inside now. Luke de Jong just got to clear. No, okay. Thought we could have got a tackle in. Dembele. Do not, do not let them equalise. Casemiro, thank you. Hazard now. You can see Benzema making a run. You can see Mbappe at the back post. Going to cross it in. It's in towards Benzema. Can he finish? I thought Mbappe could have gotten the rebound. Barella can play that one. Mbappe is going to play it back. Okay. Casemiro out wide. Mendy, little chip inside. Go on, finish. And he's in. There we go. And by the way, guys, I did notice the call Benzema and Mbappe. But there we go. Hazard makes it two. 76 minutes in. That has to confirm the win. And I believe now we go back up 14 points clear at the top of the table. Mendy, look at that. Little chip inside. Hazard. To be honest, I thought I was going for Benzema, but it wasn't. Hazard was there. Finishes it off. Let's get Valverde on as well. And there we go. 2-0 now. Barcelona now putting it together. An attack of their own. Dembele, Luke de Jong, who hasn't really caused us many problems. Frankie de Jong has, though. Botman, great defending. They've still got the ball. Okay. Come on. Don't give up the clean sheet now. Don't give up the clean sheet, Botman. Again, Botman is unreal. Okay, fair enough, give away the corner, but still. Barcelona, maybe one last attack. We win the header. Maybe we'll get last attack. And okay, never mind. There we go. A minute added on. That should be a win. Maybe another attack here. Hazard just can't get the better of his Sullier. And there you go. It ends 2-0 in this El Clasico. And as we said then, guys, after that win against Barcelona, that keeps us now 14 points clear at the top of the table. And here are the teams that did make it through into the quarterfinals. And now, as you guys can see, there is a team down there, Bergamo Calcio. And they've made it through to the quarterfinals. They're taking on Man City next. Barcelona ended up getting knocked out. They got knocked out to Juventus. But uh, that, that Calcio team beat Lille 4-1. So let's see how they feel now taking on Man City. And so then, guys, we did mention earlier on which players out of this list should we go ahead and sign. And if, if anything, guys, I don't I don't really want to sign too many more wingers. But there are best options here. Vaquero and Santos looking like our best two players. So we might promote them and get them out on loan. Not going to lie then, guys. I am getting quite a little bit worried right now. Since we lost that Champions League game, we've had two emails now from the Real Madrid board about our, you know, performance meeting uh, basically a review of the season. So I'm hoping that we can win La Liga still and just make sure we get through into the second season. But let's go ahead then and finish today's episode off with another sim game, guys. Taking on Celta. I've rotated the team a little bit. Camavinga and Blanco coming into midfield. Botman coming in as well. Let's quick sim. Let's get it over and done with. And there we go. It's a 1-1 one, one draw, guys. Can you believe it? Benzema with the goal. But there we go, then, guys. Going to leave it there for today's episode. Not really too sure how long today's episode is. But obviously, now being knocked out of the Champions League, next episode, we're going to wrap up La Liga and get ready for the start of Season 2. So if you guys enjoyed today's episode, please let me know. Drop a like down below on the video. Hit the subscribe button if you're new. And I'll catch you guys in the next episode.